But now you can do performances on your own in your apartment wherever you are now because you've just I live moved. alone. I know. Just, your nice. first time, you've got your own place on your own. Yeah. How's it going? It's good. Um, thank you. Thank you. You guys, thank you. Thanks, you know, I'm 28 years old. <laughs> It's important to know that Reggie kicked that applause off. Yeah, I don't want Reggie. Them to think that <laughs> I want to she lives alone. <laughs> um, yeah. How's it going? It's great. Um, I do have like a form, a kind of roommate, because I have um, constant rat problems. Oh. And I, oh. yeah. But I also like now made friends with my pest control guy, Ernie. Right. <laughs> I don't know what camera I'm supposed to be looking into, but like I hope Ernie sees this one day because he and I hang out a lot. Oh. <laughs> do you um, think it's one rat or do you think No, because they fight. Oh, they that's make great. a lot of noises in the attic. And I heard it and I thought maybe it was just like a creature jumping on my roof. But then in the morning a banana was like scraped out like this. <gasps> and so I was thinking, because my sister is over the day before, and I was like, did she eat a banana with a fork and then like <laughs> not throw the banana away? But like I don't think that is happened. that something your sister would do? No, that's what, no. You no. know what, nobody does that. No. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's my point, I mean. But I did, I couldn't imagine that a rat decided to skillfully eat one banana. Yeah. And so then the next night I left the bananas again because I was like, that's crazy. And it happened again. And then the third night I took away all the fruit and they got into my shallots and garlic. No. And took it out of the bowl and ate it on the stove top. That might have been an Italian rat. <laughs>